She would have been just shy of her fifth birthday when her body was placed in the dumpster. A young girl found dead in a dumpster identified. Tonight, Toronto police with an update on a disturbing discovery in Rosedale just over a year ago. Good evening. It is a heartbreaking mystery that gripped the city. And while so many questions about the girl's death remain unanswered, at least now we know her name. CTV Siobhan Morris joins us live from police headquarters where the lead investigator held a news conference late this afternoon. Siobhan. Well, Nathan, if you think of this case as a jigsaw puzzle, we know that one piece is now in focus. Inspector Hank and Zenga says we got to this point after a tip was that came into police many months ago and some DNA evidence. So police do now have a name for the remains of the girl that were found in a dumpster outside a home under construction in Rosedale last May. Police didn't know her name, where she'd come from, even how old she might have been. So they pulled together a composite sketch based on her remains to try and help the case along. Police believe that she may have died as far back as the summer of 2021, but they weren't really sure. Now, with an identification of this girl, police are able to say that she was placed in that dumpster right before her fifth birthday. Thanks to a tip from the community and some great work by investigators and the Center of Forensic Sciences, I can now identify this little girl as Navia Tucker of Toronto. The tip itself wasn't specific, let me say that. It, it pointed us in a direction and a lot of work had to be done uh, on that information. Um, it, it actually did identify somebody else as being the potential victim, uh, but the windfall from that tip ended, ended up taking us in the right direction. So it was a lot of work. Um, and we're very grateful to the person who did call in and provide us with that information. It gave us that little jigsaw puzzle piece and we were able to build from there. And Zenga admits there's still a lot of work ahead, including trying to solve the answer of how Navia died. Was it murder? Was it an accident? Some, sort of, uh, some form of neglect? We do know that her mother was notified of her identification as the girl in the dumpster earlier today. We don't have any information, though, about what her family situation, where she might have been living before her death. Reporting live, I'm Siobhan Morris. Nathan and Michelle, back to you.